Hello, this is part three of uh, carving the model 1911 pistol grips. Right now I've got all the outline done and I'm working at wasting away the background. Um, so I'm just pushing it back. This is a fairly thin piece of ivory and because it is what it is, I try not to take off too much material to maintain the integrity uh, of the pistol grip. So I'm using a fairly shallow base relief and as I said I've got everything outlined so I'm taking the background down with the chisel it's they call it walking engraving or rocker engraving that's your got your chisel upside down to how you'd usually use a chisel and I uh, set it into that starting point there and you literally just walk it across the surface and you, you can see the chips flying off of it with very little effort and just move down and, uh, for me at this uh, this type of carving i prefer this over power tool just because a power tool can be pretty aggressive at times and harder to get a an even layer taken off this chisel this technique really only takes so much each pass so you get a pretty nice even field behind there and uh, it moves right along get into a zone um, but yeah it uh it makes chips so anyway this is how I'm doing it um, after you get the background kind of um, wasted away like that you can take the chisel and go around and sort of clean up the, the edges and then once you get to that point I moved to this uh, tool here, which is a, a triangular little knife that I made. Um, I make most of my tools out of jewelers' files or other files, a nice hard carbon steel. Hard enough, I don't need anything too fancy. Um, <clears throat> I've already started a little bit up here, but because the surface now is all gnarled up and uh, little bumps, you know, those bumps are kind of uh, weak and vulnerable to, uh, to attack by the knife. So you come along and Break them right off. This is, uh, I'm going to take down the whole background. And, um, over it with uh, various grades of sandpaper to finish leveling and smoothing it. Gives you more control for one thing, uh, gives you a lot more power for another. Anyway, you can see that that's uh, smoothing off quite nicely. And, uh, so I'm going get, to get back to it and finish up this last little bit. And uh, thanks for tagging along, and we'll see you the next next episode.